hello guys welcome to the channel professor bubens today we'll see the energy profile diagram of sn2 reaction as in previous video we have already seen that when methyl bromide is treated with sodium hydroxide it forms methyl alcohol and sodium bromide as a byproduct so it has particular uh, energy profile diagram it passes through the transition state that we'll see the explanation of that so here it is so in energy profile diagram uh, these are the axis x and y axis so on this axis it is the energy that is the energy of uh, reaction and on second axis this is the time that is the progression of the reaction so in first these are the reactants that is methyl bromide is uh, reacting with sodium hydroxide when this sodium hydroxide splits into Na plus and OH minus, this OH minus acts as a nucleophile and it attacks on a carbon and it forms a transition state. That is the partial attachment of nucleophile that is OH minus on the carbon and uh, uh, as well as the partial attachment of the living group bromine and this is called a transition state. It has the highest energy state of the reaction comparatively this reaction is slow up to this transition transition state but after this it goes faster and it forms a product that is the methyl alcohol and sodium bromide as a byproduct so methyl alcohol it forms with 100% inversion as we, ha uh, we have seen in previous video so here it is this is the difference between the energy it is called the energy of activation that is energy required to proceed for the reaction it is the difference between the energy of reactant and transition state now the difference between energy of product and the reactant it is called the internal energy of the reaction that is the reaction enthalpy so this is the complete about the energy profile diagram of sn2 so in next video we'll see the sn1 reaction mechanism so stay connected and hope you like this video so please share comment and subscribe to the channel professor bubens thank you